We are almost one month out from the start of the Winter Olympics in South Korea. Viewers have been reaching out to KXAN's Erin Cargyle, giving her advice before she takes off to cover the games. Well, today, one Central Texan invited Erin to her home to share her own unique Olympic experience. You know, most of the memories fading away. For the last two weeks, Misha Lee has been digging through boxes and putting keepsakes on display that have been packed away for nearly 30 years. I forgot. <laughs> At the age of 41, while living in L.A., she took a temporary gig in her home country. In 1987, I saw the article you know, in the newspaper, Korea Times, so I applied right away. After a year of training, she joined 500 other Korean English speakers to volunteer for the 1988 Summer Olympics in Seoul, South Korea. That's a happy face. Lee was a guide for the 29 athletes and officials from Zambia in Africa. For me, it gave to me hope, pride, courage, and the confidence. It helped me a lot. She paid a visit to Pyeongchang on a trip to Asia in September and was filled with pride once again, not fear about their neighbors to the north. All the time they threatening us for almost 65 years. Yeah, since 1945. So we just uh, still focus on daily life. After a quick lesson saying hello. 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. Uh -huh. 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. Thank you. We talked about getting together again when I get back. My heart is beating with joy. So I guess in a way in the future, you and I have a bond. In Leander, Aaron Cargyle, KXAN News. And Aaron will be at the upcoming Winter Olympics in South Korea. You can catch her reports starting in February.